Prophet, peace be upon him, would then recite another chapter from the Quran. Chapter 112 The Purity Surah Al Ikhlas Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Qul Huwa Allahu Ahad Allahu Samad Lam Yalid Walam Yulad Walam Yakullahu Kufuan Ahad In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. Say, O Muhammad, he is Allah, the one, Allah, the self-sufficient. He does not produce a child, and he was not born of anyone, and there is no one equal to him. Manner of Recitation The Prophet, peace be upon him, would recite the Quran in slow, measured, rhythmic tones as Allah had instructed him, not racing or hurrying, but rather in his recitation he would clearly distinguish each letter. He would also pause at the end of each verse. The Ruku, Bowing After completing his recitation, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would pause for a moment, then raise his hands, saying the Takbir, as it was done at the beginning of the prayer, and then bow. Allahu Akbar meaning Allah is the greatest. When the Prophet, peace be upon him, bowed in prayer, he kept his back level, such that if water was poured on it, the water would not run off. The Prophet, peace be upon him, would not let his head hang down, nor would he raise it. The Prophet, peace be upon him, would place his hands firmly on his knees, as though he were grasping them, with his fingers spaced out. Supplication in the bowing position. In the bowing position, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would say three times, Subhana Rabbi al Azim. Subhana Rabbi al Azim. Subhana Rabbi al Azim. Meaning, How perfect is my Lord, the Supreme. Straightening up from the bowing position. Muhammad, peace be upon him, would then straighten up his back from the bowing position while raising his hands and saying, Sami Allahu liman hamidah. Meaning, Allah listens to one who praises him. In the standing position, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would then say, Rabbana walakal hamd meaning, O Lord, and to you be all praise. Sajda, prostration. Muhammad, peace be upon him, would then say the takbir and go down in prostration. Allahu Akbar. During prostration, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would prostrate on seven parts of his body, his forehead and the tip of his nose, both hands level with the ears, pointing towards the Qibla, with the arms away from his sides, both knees, both feet with the bottom of the toes pointing towards the Qibla, keeping the heels together. Supplication in the prostrating position. In prostration, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would say three times, Subhana Rabbi al-A'la Subhana Rabbi al-A'la Subhana Rabbi al-A'la Meaning, How perfect is my Lord, the Most High. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, The nearest a servant comes to his Lord is during prostration, so make supplication in this position. Rising from the prostration, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would then raise his head from the prostration while saying the takbir. Allahu Akbar. Jalsa, the sitting position. In the sitting position, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would sit on his left thigh and foot, with his right foot upright, pointing his toes towards the Qibla. Supplication in the sitting position. 
In the sitting position, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would say, My Lord, forgive me, my Lord, forgive me. Muhammad, peace be upon him, would again say the takbir and prostrate a second time. Allahu Akbar meaning Allah is the greatest. In prostration, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would say three times, Subhana Rabbi al-A'la Subhana Rabbi al-A'la Subhana Rabbi al-A'la How perfect is my Lord! 